Nigel Farage has just given this country a lifeline. It's an extraordinary gift, really, to the, the people of this country. And I have to say, when he said today that he senses that something is changing in this country, and that we're witnessing something that we've never witnessed before in our lifetimes in politics, I completely agree with him. Never before have people, in my experience of life, been so disappointed with the political class and they are actually ready for a revolt. And to have Nigel come out today and say that he is going to lead that revolt against the political class and the business as usual and the ghastly mess that people have experienced and witnessed from one end of the political spectrum to the other. You know, the Conservatives, frankly, deserve a bloody nose, but the Labour Party and Keir Starmer, they are no better. In fact, they will almost certainly be worse. So, Nigel, as somebody who has observed and has been a keen supporter of all aspects of the freedom fighting campaigns that you have uh, initiated and uh, really done an extraordinary job with over the past decades, I have to say that this may well be the greatest gift that you could possibly have given to the people of this country. You are leading a people's revolt and there is no question that today's political class are absolutely ghastly. They are revolting indeed and they deserve to be revolted against. Um, I think it's a credit to you that you've changed your mind. And uh, the fact that you've changed your mind, I think, is a great, great uh, gift of a human being. I don't think it's anything to be, as you said today, it's nothing to be ashamed of at all. Minds are for changing. And I think over the next few days, we are going to see an awful lot of people change their minds. I know I've spoken to people. Uh, I've been receiving calls all evening, actually, from people who are died in the wool, died in the wool conservative voters, have never voted any other party in their lives. And they're saying, well, they're now not only going to vote for reform, but they are going to be donating. And, uh, I, you know, it's it's extraordinary right the way across the political spectrum. So good luck to you. Uh, we send you our very, very best wishes here from Cornwall. And certainly, uh, you're a winner. And I think there's every chance that you will have a fantastic win on this great new adventure. Good luck, Nigel.